he thrives on being able to fight anywhere, especially if it leads to him bringing out one of his tables. What else is going on? And whoa, DDT by Psycho Edge. That's certainly what's going on. And oh, wait a minute. Oh, he just smashes his face across the steel stairs, and here he goes. And if you, and if you've noticed, Steve Farrell's been busted open like a can of tomato paste. And so far, this has been a great opener here on Aftershock. And Psycho Edge. And, oh, crack the elbow. That sends Nage back inside the ring. Ah, <coughs> oh, what a cheap shot by Farrell. But hey, again, and like I said, he he patterned himself after Ric Flair. There. It's like somebody on YouTube said, and Steve Farrell is the second coming of Ric Flair. There. And right now he's just demonstrating that. And look out, we just saw one of those knife edge chops right there. We saw a couple of them actually. Woo! 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 Oh, and Farrell shooting him up. I mean, Nate is covered in blood right now, but he's but he's gonna try to get a win right here. <laughs> Clipping Psycho Edge's leg. And oh wait a minute. Hey, Steve Farrell! Steve Farrell's got the figure four locked in a second time! Hey, I mean, Psycho Edge gonna tap out! Yes! Psycho Edge taps out! Steve Farrell moves on to the second round of the Royal Showdown! Um, here on Aftershock, he defeats Psycho Edge via submission with that figure four. Guys, we got more to come. We'll be back. Stay with us. Go. We just heard it from Darby and April the B.I. And wait a minute! Psycho Edge! Edge with a table just ambushed Vincent in the back! Hey, what the hell is this about? Is he that sore about losing that last matchup to Steve Farrell? Oh, that Royal Showdown match that he's got to take it out on somebody who wasn't even involved in it? What the hell is this problem? He just cut up on him with a concrete! <laughs> this is out in the parking lot, I think. And Psycho Edge has got him up! Oh no! Oh, oh my god! Right through the table! Well, and onto the concrete! And oh, wait a minute! No! Oh! Sweet mother of god! Oh, it's Psycho Edge with the execution! I don't believe that! He's challenged into a tables match! Alright, let's get up! Let's get set for our second match! And I cannot believe what we just saw from Psycho Edge right there moments ago. Just laying out Vincent backstage for apparently no reason. I mean, maybe there's still some bad blood issues stemming from Vendetta. But if I try to get a word from Psycho Edge about it, I probably won't get an answer. Anyway, Greg Hurst is on his way out here for this Royal Showdown matchup. Of course, whoever wins this goes on to round two at the Royal Showdown. And, be, and either Greg Hurst or Slayer will be facing off against Steve Farrell, who defeated Psycho Edge by submission in earlier tonight, which obviously prompted Psycho Edge's little, you know, I don't understand what goes on inside the minds of some of these guys. Hey, really. It's all you can.
But anyway. Let me just, let me just get my head together for a second. Slayer's making his way out here. And you know... Great. I'm completely off my game here. Here, thanks a lot, Psycho Edge, you freaking table rapist. Throwing off my commentary equilibrium for the night. Now I'm going to have to start over. <laughs> but anyway. Hey, Slayer's out here. Of course, normally he's a tag team specialist. But of course, he's got a big singles opportunity here. Because this is the Royal Showdown Tournament. We are underway. And of course, whoever wins this thing and at the Royal Showdown automatically becomes number one contender to the BYU World Title at the Summer Bash and Slayer starting this matchup off nicely then again that's what you gotta do when you're in there against Greg Hurst you gotta be, be a lightning quick because Greg Hurst is lightning quick I always like to call him the master of the destiny DDT because he can bring that thing out anytime Hey, and you talk about DDTs, Slayer knows just when to hit one on you as he just hit a springboard moonsault. There's two. No. Two count only. You're not going to stop someone with a springboard moonsault so early in the match, but it's certainly a good wear down tactic. But great Hurst now. Nice elevation on the backbreaker. And just sends him. Oh, into an arm drag. We've been seeing a lot of arm drags and changing this matchup up at at quick pick is reminiscent of the reminiscent of Ricky the Dragon Steamboat, a former champion is Whoa, two count only. Greg Hurst tried for a roll up there, but yeah. Uh, that's like classic wrestling man, reminiscent of legends like Ricky the Dragon Steamboat oh, and guys like that, you know? And Greg Hurst with a pop driver. And Slayer looked like he was having a seizure there for a moment. And now Greg Hurst with an inverted STF on Slayer. No submission. And now, wait a minute, Hurst, putting him up here, er, er, all the way from the top, into a side slam! Man, Greg Hurst is so athletic, so agile, I mean, what more can I say about it? Man. Oh, wait a minute, though, Slayer with a switch, he's going to turn this one right around, there's the suplex! And Slayer drops the elbow! Drops the elbow with precision and Greg Hurst, Hurst goes for a dragon suplex but only gets two. And right now... Oh, wait a minute! And Slayer just sent him out right there and oh drops the elbow on the outside I don't know if he got the impact he wanted from that though and Greg Hurst is gonna capitalize and he's oh right in the barricade yeah. look at him just throw those shots <laughs> that's oh uh, oh! Look at him just smash him across that turnbuckle. It's like he's, it's like he's trying to convert Slayer into being a tree hugger. <laughs> I'm always kidding. I'm always kidding, guys. But seriously, a Greg Hurst is right now is just the dominant figure, which is probably what he needs to be. Wait a minute, Greg Hurst is going to send him out right into that other turnbuckle. Wait a minute, oh wait a minute, here it comes Destiny DDT! Destiny DDT! 
He hits it every time with precision. And this one's going to be over. Gray Hurst goes for it. No. Damn. Slayer with a... Slayer kicks out at two. Oh, my God. And Hurst throws him off the ropes. Into it. Ah. Oh. Slayer counters with that DDT. And now he's going to go up. And here comes the elbow. Ah. Oh. Slayer. 